Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I thought I'd do this video where I show you guys products that I have in my nightstand. This carousel right here are all of the skincare and all other products that I have that I use on a day-to-day -day basis. Just something that I can easily reach for when I'm on my bed and I'm getting ready to go to sleep. Let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to bring you guys closer and show you what I have on my nightstand. Okay guys, so this is what I have. I have this kind of carousel makeup organizer where I keep all of the items that I need and I constantly reach for. Everything and anything could be found in here. Like, let's start with this one, just miscellaneous stuff. My earphones. Sometimes I edit videos and my husband doesn't like me editing because it's too loud while he's watching TV. So I put on my headphones and I just edit away. Oh, can you guys see? An addition to my nightstand is a hand sanitizer. So I try to hand sanitize whenever I can. And I also let my kids hand sanitize as well. Let's just start with this one. This rack above my headphones. I have my favorite moisturizer right here. The First Aid Beauty Face Moisturizer. Love this. And also, I'm testing out this new product from Bare Minerals. They sent this to me. It is a anti-aging serum. As you can see, I just started, but it's already gone down significantly. I think I've been using it for a good two weeks straight already. I'll have a review for you guys on this, but this was sent to me free and I was so excited that I got to try it. And then, oh, this is almost an empty for me, the fresh, black tea kombucha facial treatment essence so this is a good essence guys i like to do all of my skincare while i'm on my bed except the cleansing and maybe the exfoliating part but otherwise i love to do the rest of my skincare on my bed so that's why i have the essence right here uh, this one is something that i got from boxycharm it's one of those crazy expensive skincare again this is by kaip but I love this it's an antioxidant dew and it keeps my skin really moisturized I cycle through my serums like I go from one to, to the other depending on my skin needs that day and when I feel like my skin is really dry it needs some pick-me-up and it's an antioxidant so it's good against pollution and you know environmental damage so love this ah the murad rapid collagen infusion i can't remember if i got this in my fabfitfun or my boxycharm box but i got it at a very reasonable price and you guys know i love collagen another serum that i cycle through at least once or twice a week i put this on and then up here guys my facial roller this is a white quartz I use this almost every night, massages my face, and it just helps the serum absorb way better into the skin, so love that. This one I don't use often. This is kind of like that red light therapy. It's supposed to help with anti-aging. I don't know that it does anything. It does feel a little warm to the touch when you put it on your skin. Um, it's just a little too time consuming for me to use, so I think that's why I don't use it as often. You guys know if you've watched my Grove unboxing, um, I have this deep breath oil that has the metal roller ball right here this is by grove collaborative i love this i use this almost every night ever since i got it the qms uh, medi cosmetic lip liner corrector i don't know about this i got this in my boxy charm box i think I'm mixing the items that I got from FabFitFun versus BoxyCharm because they do have products and brands that overlap, so sometimes I forget. But this QMS one, the lip line corrector, I kind of stopped using it after I got some irritation on my lips. Um, I, I'm afraid to try it again, but the kind of irritation I had on my lips took a while, like over 
I want to say two weeks to disappear it was just overall annoying like it kept making my lips really really dry I can't entirely blame this I'll probably give it a try again for another week and see if it's coming from this product or I just put on an old lipstick this is like over a hundred dollars I think but it's so fancy you know with with how it dispenses the product but yeah not my favorite but it's here because i still want to give it a chance this is the 111 skin Ooh, i got this from my boxy's charm box pretty recently if you want to watch the unboxing i'll put it up in the cards and it's an anti-pollution defense serum i believe it helps with blue light protection too so can't wait to try this on a daily basis but i don't want to try too many serums at the same time other things that i'm trying oh this body lotion it's a little sample or deluxe size sample from drunk elephant don't get it it's a meh i'm just finishing it off it's a nice lotion i don't know how hydrating it's gonna be during the winter season but it's all right these two i'm just testing right now the origins high potency nitamins resurfacing cream and the shiseido one power infusing concentrate i will update you guys with that glossier yes i am trying all these glossier skincare guys it's coming up on a future video can't wait to tell you guys all about glossier and it's a pretty popular brand i think it's a very minimalistic brand i love the packaging guys um and i can tell you right now i love two out of the three of these so i'll let you know in my review video and this is another sample one from tarte it's a tarte moisturizer like rainforest or something like that it's a gel moisturizer and i love it the face story artemisia it's a balancing light facial cream it's pretty much a moisturizer i love this moisturizer it feels great on the screen on the skin it's a little bit heavier than gel but really good you guys know i'm a face story affiliate you can use my code down below in case you want to purchase this but face story created their own brand of products that are more clean less chemicals and so i highly recommend this one as well i have a lemon cello hand cream from perfectly posh i reviewed one of their moss be love hydrating mask so check that video out but yeah it smells so good just like lemons and it has like a citrusy scent to it it's a lightweight moisturizer oh and it also has honey so i love the honey ingredients in skincare and perfectly posh it has naturally based ingredients so i think you guys would love this as well i'm not sure where i got this from it was given to me but it's a foot lotion and i've never had a foot lotion before so i was like okay i'll give it a chance um it's not bad whenever i have some crusty dry feet i'll put this on ah the deep spray pillow spray i got this from my fab fit fun box guys my husband hates the scent of it it is really pretty earthy scent i feel like i have a more restful sleep when i spray this on my pillow and this is another one deep sleep cocoon body cocoon multitasking beauty sleep i haven't used this much so i can't tell you much about this product yet um, but it's supposed to help you relax it's a lotion that you slather all over your body and it's supposed to give you a good night's sleep it's all right i've only tried it once so i can't say much about it oh this one is a wonder oil i love to smell this actually i love the scent my mom gave this i think she bought this from the philippines when you feel like you're dizzy or you're just not feeling well it's a nice thing to put on your temples on the back of your ears all right so that's this and the top right here i think we covered that and let's go to the next one this is another perfectly posh product this is one of my favorite products from posh guys look at this and it's purple it's a stress melting body butter i have a chronic back and neck pain it's nice and thick and it just helps with like muscular pain it's just very soothing it has that cooling sensation 
that you need for the body when it's really tight and stressed so love that about it okay i still have this kate somerville goat milk i don't like it it's a moisturizer so it looks like that it's just okay for me i don't like it i wouldn't repurchase it again it dries down and it makes my face sticky so i don't know maybe i could use this under makeup but it's not my favorite at all the next one on my nightstand is patchology eye patches so it looks like this it comes with the scoop can you guys see it right there I love doing this at night when I'm all relaxed. I've done all my skincare. It's a five minute routine, nice and quick. It's not something you have to keep on very long, which I like. So I always make time for this. The bottom one, we're not going to talk about it. There's nasal sprays for me and my daughter. Okay, next one. We have my Bath and Body Works Love Body Cream. Smells amazing. This is from um, Bath and Body Works Aroma Therapy line. A lot more expensive than the regular lotions. It's supposed to give you more relaxation. The cream in itself is more moisturizing, definitely intense. I love it during the winter time. This is something that I hauled in my Bath and Body Works from last winter. So I'll link that below if you guys want to watch that video. I know I love watching Bath and Body Works hauls. So this one is the Avant Shea Butter Rich Pathanol Age Radiant Sleeping Mask haven't used this much the kusho cooling spot therapy when i have headaches i put this on i got this from my fat fit fun box i put it on my temples on the back of my ears down my neck it just gives you that cooling sensation helps you relax better oh this exfoliating foot mask i think i've used it two times already it's another thing like when i'm already showered at night and i'm on my bed if i want to do that extra spa moment for my feet i put this on you put it on your foot like a lotion you go to bed with it and the next day you rinse it off um, it's not sticky, it feels smooth on the legs, and your legs look much, much better the next day. So love this. We'll speed through this. I've got the Laneige. Everybody knows about this. This is their lip gloss or lip sleeping mask. Trying this out, my friend. Let me try the Dr. Dennis Gross or Gross. Wait. I forgot the name i'll put the name of the skincare brand but this is an eye cream oh my gosh it feels like when i put this on literally lifting my eyes have an olay eyes deep hydrating eye gel it's very hydrating cooling to the touch love it over here this is like a perfume bottle and this is by loxiton and i did an unboxing of their advent calendar last christmas and so this is one of the bottles that i have it's kind of like a perfume but i think it's another one of those aromatherapy stuff because it has that minty scent to it skin iceland solutions it's a brightening eye serum it's sticky i don't like this but i just want to finish it off good jeans sunday riley i always want to try the sunday riley brand i want to try more but they're so expensive so this is just like a trial size oh this one is the healer stick from perfectly posh and it it's exactly a healer stick for dry skin so when you have dry patches on your skin when you have eczema this is great i haven't tried this anti-wrinkle sd advanced plus by strivectin potency by peter thomas roth i'm not sure if i like it okay these are my current lip glosses one from pixie from loxitan and also from glossier so so far i am loving these okay i think we've gone through all of the bottom racks and everything else above it what is this oh argan oil 
when you have extremely dry skin. I sometimes use it for my cuticles as well. And the middle portion right here, guys, is pretty much my eye creams at the moment. I have the Pickup Limes from Perfectly Posh. I have one from Face Story. I have one from Dr. Brand. And right now, I'm focusing on the one from Face Story. I love this eye cream. It's so hydrating when you have like really dry under eyes this is perfect i don't know that it does anything else but definitely it's a refreshing eye cream the 24 7 retinol cream i want to try this but i want to make sure i try this um, on its own without any other eye cream so i'm gonna get started on this next and the pickup limes i just started on this as well okay guys so that is everything that is on my nightstand i hope you guys enjoyed this video i feel like you guys got to know me more i feel like we're closer in a way you know because normally you don't show these things that are on your nightstand it can be a little bit messy if you have any questions about these products let me know comment down below and i'll try my best to answer them i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already i post videos once a week on skincare and beauty reviews as well as some unboxings here and there i hope you guys are having a great rest of your day and i'll definitely see you back in my corner soon bye